Hello everyone to the... Ah, okay, uh, they're going f uh, already. Uh, I was not expecting that. Mm. Welcome everyone to this match between Mephisto and Cypher. I don't, I'm not currently sure which group this is. With me in the commentary booth for the first time, uh, we have uh, Fobsy. Hello, thank you for having me. It is a group A match. Mephisto and Cypher. I did not catch the lineups, uh, unfortunately. If you, if you, did they send it to you? Uh, so they didn't send it to me. I remember Mephisto's brought on orderly to over the top, which is quite an interesting choice. But I feel like there's not too many good orderly picks for the maps they have. Yeah, this set of three maps is definitely a set of three maps, all right. <laughs> it uh, is a crazy one, yeah. Uh, two maps That's with artilleries good. is definitely unusual, I'd say, out of the three maps with artillery we have. <laughs> yeah. Um, Artilleries just change the game as well. Yeah. It's such a different game with them. So this orderly doesn't really have much of a choice in who to drink. I think this is the only one who's available. But it is at least a para. I'm not sure if this is even the first. Wow. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> is it perfect or not? It allows Mephisto to have a choice in which artillery he goes for sure. But um, that means that the Momo can be reversed relatively easily. Or True. better that the para can have his turn before the medic again. Cypher has two powers as well, so I think his next one will just go after it. The next so one still... will go for the artillery, I hope. Otherwise Mephisto is just winning by the virtue of having 200 armor. Yes, exactly. Okay, that's, uh, that's an artillery. With a floating mine on top of the scout, nice. <laughs> Interesting, they didn't go for the heavy shell at first and instead went for a mine shell. So I think that idea comes from a match ADB played uh, at some point where he uh, blocked blocked in a peak of uh, his opponent with that very artillery. Oh, wow. So, is there a pick left here? Yeah, there has to be, but it's a scout. Oh, that's a that's a bad turn. There are two scouts there, and Cypher getting the power completely wrong, just destroying the crate with uh, mortar or bazooka. I'm not quite sure. Yeah, that's uh, that's definitely a very big disadvantage for Cypher right there. Mephisto still can use his shell. So he yeah, wasting needs... the heavy shell is bad. So Cypher kinda needs to move away from Mephisto's artillery uh, now. <laughs> yes. Is there two picks on that side? Mm, yeah, there are two picks. But they both will have their turn. Well, only one anymore because the para already moved. Or oh, is this hitting a mine? Oh, good shot. I wonder if there was mine damage possible if it had hit the mine behind him. <laughs> Probably if it's the right one. Mephisto off to a really good start anyway. He's taking control of the game so far. I just noticed that I had the game way too quiet, the stream. Uh, so for the first, like... Oh, oh no! Cypher is out of... Uh, does not have control of this match, I think. At least not good. But the poison was strong. That's a... That's a good recovery. Just the position good is... Good there. This skip I have Very not pure. figured out how to do, but oh well. Wow. Whenever I played over the top, we 
stayed very much in our own halves. So it's very interesting to see Mephisto just invade that other side. And it is working. Mm, is this working though? Uh, if it's like... Oh no, it is. Okay. Ooh. He must have learned all Good the ranges friend. and stuff. Yeah, I think almost everyone of Cypher's team is already poisoned, whereas Mephisto still has so many unpoisoned pigs. Yes. Okay, Cypher doing a good job at avoiding that mine. He also does have two scouts, so he can pull the poison game back. You'd always be looking to poison the orderly here, but he's so close to the para that it is. Yeah, such a tough shot. It was tough, yeah. You would have needed to roll yes. the thing over the hill and... Blech. Difficult. 40 a good choice there. I wonder if it isn't already too late for Cypher given the amount of damage he didn't deal. Hmm. Okay. It's tough to say. Okay, I'm a friend of uh, this move. Because it's punching uh, up. Or, yes. if it's uh, going even worse for Cypher, he, uh, this guy lands in the water and doesn't come out of it again. Nope. Oh, it's just nice. punching up. Wait, he's walking in bounds. Oh. oh. <laughs> you never know with those uh, returning inbounds peaks. You never know. You really don't. That could have been scary. Still a very good turn from Mephisto again. Cypher responds. Another good choice. By bunching up another pick in there. Yeah, why not? Maybe you can get a bit luckier with the, the war. Oh, the positioning is rough. Not great. So, do you know what happens if a. or what can happen if a pick goes into the water here? And out of bones range. Ah, no, not that. So, basically, they swim not towards one either side of the river, but along the river. Not sure. So usually a pig would just swim to the closest tile of land they see, right? Ah, sorry. No, yeah. It is really weird around that river, isn't it? And on this map, they would just swim somewhere along the river until, the riv until they die. <laughs> yeah, sorry. I've never been done bad, but... In a, in a match but in practice yeah yeah it's i've really... seen it happen too often even in the match at least ah uh, yeah not a bad choice but i i'm not sure if this will hit unless the shot is perfect this is such a tough shot yeah so much water around them looks short and a blue pair no like... this is this oh, is the perfect, is perfect shot i was talking about Oh, we see water? Okay, he's just there. Oh. Okay, I'm not sure what how much health... Pizza. I'm not sure how much, uh, how much health that scout is on, but it can't be much, given that he was also poisoned. Maybe Cypher... Maybe Cypher needs to kill him. I wouldn't be surprised. Cypher will... Nice! Here. Oh no, he isn't poisoned, okay. 63 still. Ah, was it the poison scout that got killed? Well then I guess it's unfortunate for Mephisto that that happened. Oh, this is also a beautiful shot by Cypher. Good shot. And the abbots have dropped in the meantime. I assume Mephisto just wants to get rid of the poison for from Cypher to basically ensure his victory here. He 
Yeah, this shot was a little bit... He's down, but he's not that can get him in the water. Wait. I think he's prepared for a poison skip now. I, I mean, he would be if it isn't his turn now. <laughs> yeah. Cypher preventing that thing. No skipping for him. Does he now poison the medic? He kinda has to. This time it's even easy. Look at the distance between them. Uh, oh, it's such a tough shot, but I see no other way of getting back into this game. Yeah, that won't cut it, I think. Just repping that gap between them. Bigger and bigger. Yeah, the health bar says it's decently uh, balanced still, but I don't see it personally. If he's still... No. He does still have an artillery to deal with, but... They both have. Cypher that's... also does too, so... This is a shot I wouldn't risk as Mephisto, but he gets a oh. absolutely great double poison. Wow. <laughs> That is... wow. <laughs> that was definitely the best shot of the game to, uh, so far. Without a doubt. The accuracy with which uh, Mephisto is playing today is uh, insane. All his Took shots have been on point, everything. Mephisto's on his game, he is a scary opponent. I played him once in Middle League last year and it did not end well at all for me. <laughs> I can imagine. Okay, Cypher just going for the simple TNT. Maybe a river. Who knows? A river would really help him here. Yes, you've got to play with the river here. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, okay. He, I'm Cypher. He's dead. Oh. He would have found land. By accident, too. <laughs> but Excellent. <laughs> accident. Uh, but just before he dies, that was huge damage. I think about 70 to 80? With that TNT? Yeah. That is... That's just what he has to keep on doing. Yeah, but Mephisto will be a little bit more worried to put his piece not in range of that thing anymore. Yeah. Mephisto's a very smart player. He will know. Cypher's only way of getting back in the game is the river. Yeah, given the little amount of mistakes from Mephisto. I mean, this this medic is dead. He is. He will just uh, jetpack this scout now and then bazooka the medic, I assume. So he has enough time. Yeah. Yeah, going into a better position to... Kill this guy. Very good turn from Cypher. This medic's still at a drank left, so maybe a little bit early for Mephisto to uh, already get rid of the MoMA situation without a medic. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I think he's done enough. But Cypher stringing some good shots together. I think a short range shot could reach there potentially, but I think it might only apply to the poison shell. It could reach the paratrooper for sure. Ooh. Not quite enough. Not quite enough, but is it his turn now? No. So what are you doing as Cypher now? This guy will be mm. slow as fuck. Oh, 
Oh, that's a tough one. Definitely suicide if he gets a chance. I don't know if he could reach Poison, that. I'd say. Sapper right there. Poison shell. Because he would go to yeah, but... 60. It's... And then a TNT with a self destruction from the Sapper would bring him to skip, unless he is first. But I think the poison shell is the more is the better one here because now Cipher Cipher can do shit. Yeah, he can read that. Tad unlock. Okay, yeah. With uh, pig so healthy, he can just do the forehead jumps. All right. Okay. But still, I. Could be a big ask for head jumps. Wait. Can he actually do the forehead jumps? Well, probably nothing else, but he does get a skip turn out of it, so I guess it's a skip turn. Actually nice. I didn't think about the scout's ability to hide. That's a good way to use the hide. It's just a... Yes. Sorry. <laughs> it's just. Yeah, no, I was just saying. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Sorry, on you go. Yeah, this is a catapult now. Oh, if he had one. I thought that was a para. Uh, 30 is also good, right? Yeah. Ah. Cypher Stone is picking the artillery. <laughs> and Mephisto still has. Well, roller grenades. What a, well... what a great crate. I did. <laughs> oh. You're a little bit laggy. Is he also just collecting the roller grenades? Nice. <laughs> One thing I do find interesting... Oh no! Mephisto has two pigs. Uh, out of artilleries. Uh, the scout I've completely forgotten about. Does this work? If it does, then... Yeah. One more? No, it's a tw Oh no, it's a 50! Oh. He's dead. Oh. That was a nice lucky last... Uh, last flame. <laughs> that was beautiful. It's still a great shot. <laughs> oh wow. And that basically makes the artillery not really destructible, because the sapper was the only one that could easily do it. Kinda. Yeah, exactly. Um, shrapnels would have made quick work of that. I mean, it still requires two of them, right? And now it takes ages to snipe. Uh, longer than this guy has to live, I think. This is turning out to be quite even, this game. Yeah, I'm surprised. I think I would shoot next turn. Because Mephisto has the opportunity to just undo the skip with uh, whatever shell. True. It went it's for a anyway. beautiful shot, though. Excellent shot. This, to me, this year it's for uh, a joke shell. You know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm very interested to see what he does. Jetpack to make him skip? Mm. Or collect the airburst, maybe. Oh, he's just waiting, I fear. This has been an amazing comeback from Cypher. He's strung some really great it is. shots together. This yeah. is not reaching. This will destroy nothing. Oh! It does. I did not expect. What both crate drops from that? Uh, jetpacks. And they uh -huh. are both spawning on the side where Cypher's paratroopers are. Uh, 
So, so Cypher would need to go for it right now. Because he has a turn to do it. I think he uh, noticed. He does realize, it's, yeah. He's collecting on crate collecting duty. Nah, this skip is too difficult for too little payout, I think. Also just going back to the artillery. That would be a skip wasted in my in my opinion. Mm -hmm. Like yeah. Look at this. Yeah. Thing. Not really worth it, you're probably as well. Nah, uh, what did he get? Mortars? Four mortars, yeah. Yeah, not worth. They have this to is... leave the artilleries behind, uh, eventually. I was just about to say, someone will have to take the first leap out. Oh, um, is destroying the other one too? Yeah, look at this. The other jetpacks drop on Cypher's side too. It's, uh... <laughs> I see what they are doing. This is not quite a stalemate as uh, one would expect. They are emptying the artilleries, so they are of no use. Ah, right, that's smart. I didn't think of that. Right, Mephisto goes first. Mephisto's only going crate collecting. I think it's a mistake, but uh, we'll see. It, it loses him a jetpack or the artillery. Might... Oh no, it doesn't lose him a jetpack because he gets one. Oh, he's... He's leaving the artillery for the turn. Oh. Yeah, that's I was about Cypher. to say, I don't think he would get back. Oh no. Yeah, then Cypher's a very clear target with this one now. He's got one long range shell left, right? Yeah. It's the last shell of this artillery, then it's useless too. So he basically couldn't have asked for a better uh, outcome of that. If he hits us, we've got a big Looks advantage. That's good. Nah. <laughs> 15 it's is something. still damage. <laughs> yes. This is the first time in the match, in this map, that uh, Cypher has more HP than Mephisto. Wow, well, yeah. <laughs> good analysis. <laughs> and it's happened when it matters most, the end. Oh my. Mephisto has given up his artillery, I believe. That's a big mistake. His artillery is still less than a thousand pound shell. Does Cypher realize that? Job. I don't think he will. Well, we as spectators have uh, less stress at our hands and can pick up on such things easier, so. Absolutely, that was my thinking. We've all been there. We know what it's like. You get tunnel vision. Yeah, he just can't get near that artillery without going in, so... Oh, that looks long. Every missed shot is a big swing on the other side. Uh, not in terms of health bar, but in terms of uh, likelihood of winning, yeah. Although getting close to a paratrooper with uh, as many jetpacks as uh, Cypher says, I'm not sure about either. I'm still of the opinion that Cypher should have gone into Mephisto's artillery and used the thousand pound shell, but... I think that would have been the best decision, yeah. Where is... Okay, also the fact that this uh, jetpack still ate there instead of being collected by Cypher. Ooh. This looks like a juicy one. Oh, three oh, well. pallets it. Yeah, oh, Cypher he needs a... to return, uh, return the favor here. He has an air purse as well. Let's... I feel like he's still going Cypher's way. I'm not sure. At this point, I think they're both one shot after this turn. Because of the weaponry they both possess. That oh, was went very it. long. He needs to turn around in a very tight corridor. Uh. 
Oh, that looks also very that's, good. This could be it. I think he's still alive, because he only took the 70. No! Oh! Cypher does take it with uh, 60, 100, 117 damage, roughly. Wow. 117 damage on a 115. The 15 damage turned out to be crucial here. It did. Because this para still had jetpacks and he could have easily killed Cypher too. What a game. I can't. Props to Cypher, we were prepared to write him off halfway <laughs> through the game there. What? Uh, right, most of uh, Mephisto's kids came from poison. Unfortunate that he couldn't bring this to the end, but I guess that's the problem if you leave artilleries alive. Poison skips then do uh, poison skips don't really yield you anything anymore at that point because you still have to do a deal with that armor. That's and a good then point. Your, then your uh, poison skips just amount to nothing, really. The poison game was great, but ultimately... It was a waste. That's probably what to say to it. Yeah. Very well played by both of them, and we uh, we are happy to see map two, which is which one? Uh, Chill Hill. Okay, we'll be happy to see them return on Chill Hill. Awesome. And welcome back to the match between Mephisto and Cipher. Uh, this time we are on the map Chill Hill. Um, Cypher going with Medic Para, Zapper Para, and Gunner. This time we actually catch their lineups. Uh, they can go. Ah, uh, Mephisto is going with that lineup, of course. Uh, how could I confuse Cypher and Mephisto? Tell me. <laughs> oh, good. Don't worry. Yeah, so a couple things to note that is. I feel like this is heavily advantage Cypher because Mephisto used an orderly in the first map. Cypher also going with an orderly, para, scout, and double gunner. Mm, who so, went first? Shell Hill is also. It was Mephisto. Oh, yeah, then the advantage is huge for Cypher given that he won that last map. Uh, he's going first here. He will get the MoMA, most likely, unless the spawns are absolutely scrap. But you can maneuver well enough, I th I feel like. Um, yeah. At this level, I wouldn't expect it, but it's no surprise they can maneuver Chill Hill well. Mm. Coming into this league... Mephisto was my favourite to win the whole thing. <laughs> um, and he's not struggled, he's had very hard opponents, but he has picked up a couple losses. So, and be interesting to see how he responds. And the wrong player goes first, so restart, yay. There we go. Uh, yeah. Cypher, obviously, this is his first Hugs of War League, and I think he's done amazingly well. He's c competed in like really tough games. Um, he's won a map against Mephisto again. I don't believe he's got a win yet, so this could be his first. Oh, going for that selfie instead for look uh, instead of looking for the medic. But he he knew where the medic was anyway, probably from the dropping when they all flew down. Ah, uh, perfect. I have to be very careful with slippery tiles. Yeah, this looks too down. He needs to anger. Oh no, he got lucky. In, uh, if you have watched the game where Mephisto did a uh, low angle shot and missed the guy because of it. I did watch it. That was yeah. painful to watch. And it's also very painful if that happens to you. I've uh, already happened to have it happen to me as well. It's not fun. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if you remember me and you going head to head in Chill Hill, and I tried to trank your medic, and he slid all the way down the hill. So, oh, uh, uh, next to the minefield, <laughs> something. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Oh, Cypher's going for the instant destruction of this thing. 
And it worked! Wow. Perfect shot. Oh my goodness, this this para spawned not good. <laughs> um, no. So basically, the optimal thing for this paratrooper to do would be to pick up the Afrain air, uh, air strike on the other, across the entire map, right? He is as far as humanly possible. Yeah. Uh, as piggly as possible, I guess. <laughs> uh, the so crates some... Oh, what's worthless? Yeah, look at this crate. <laughs> <laughs> On the para as well. Yeah. And there's also a sword crate here, so... I don't understand the idea of bringing a scout here. I really don't. He can't deal with the artillery, so he can't... He just can't. He so can't. early in the lineup as well. Maybe he's going for... Oh, this... He really banked on getting the jump from that crate. That was very close. Is he grabbing he both really... HP crates, or is he trying to? Or yeah, he should just be trying to get the uh, strike, I suppose. Yeah. Oh wow. This is one of those turns where the turn where the oh wait, it's still hit. Oh. Cipher, take a bow. That was an absolutely incredible turn. That was. Amazing, indeed. Although, I think Cypher would have been fine with it not hitting at all. He got what he needed to get. Yeah, absolutely. Because the only thing that can destroy this artillery easily now are shrapnels. And one of those, I think, is used... Oh? Okay. Uh, against the medic now, maybe? If he still the medic, man. Makes sense, since he has uh, medic as well. It uh, does. Might even be dead now with a minefield next to him. That would be huge for him. But the oh. artillery. Yeah. Brilliant. The artillery is still there for Cypher, and uh, it hasn't used the 1000 pound shot, so that will be used. Yeah, it can basically hit anywhere on this map. I think this is a jetpack, uh, judging by the position of that crate. Oh. Good pack Explosion. Up. The next one should be a jetpack then. I'm not sure, there are so many crates that drop here so long too. It's insane. Oh, impossible to keep track of. If he loses, if Mephisto loses his medic here, I think it's GG. And it's very likely that he does. Look at this. Oh. Oh, forgive the pun, but Mephisto's got quite the hill to claim to win this. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Everything has went wrong for him, but, and it's not too much the fault of his own. Cypher's just Cypher's so very well solid with on this one, yeah. Like, perfect artillery shot, perfect movement uh, on a scout turn. And Mephisto had terrible spawns. Yeah, and he's struggling to get a good shot away here. This position, yeah, look at this. Mephisto has to fear that uh, pressure. Yeah. Bad positioning again. Why would you but waste time men menuing if you can just collect the high explosive and kill that? Yeah. Some jetpack has to be in there right now, right? Oh. <laughs> Holy shit. This gunner is loaded. <laughs> yeah, why did he collect the... Why did he choose the bazooka? He didn't use it once. No. But a beautiful grenade. Could have been a shrapnel and that way more. <laughs> yeah, 110 shrapnel that. Ah, uh, one ten maybe not, but this looked great for a shrapnel throw. Uh, throw. Yeah. Oh, but you know what's left on the map? No. A health crate. 
But that poison is not ah. tiered. So that's, I didn't even realize. That's a rare sight to see a health crate this late into the map. Yep. And for it to heal a poison as well. Good play. Yeah. So, is this a hit? Hmm. Hit. That's a good shot. 25, I don't think uh, that's uh, satisfying from the fist, so I think the artillery is now. There are many good targets for this. Uh, but the first target is uh, crate collecting, yeah. There's the jetpacks. Oh, wow. Yeah, look at this. <laughs> oh. Right, pack your poison. Power dead. No, not like that. Not like... He's not dead like that. That's not a good choice, I would say. I mean, I mean, he I will take uh, good amounts of damage. He might be dead, actually, depending on how much damage he takes. And Okay, yeah, then it was good. Not needing to Stand waste. Corrected. And I feel like I wouldn't take the risk on that, because there's still luck involved with the minefield, but it's paid off. Good, well played. I mean, you only need to get rid of half the health before it just instantly collapse, uh, dies, right? So, I guess. Yeah. On a para, it's actually decently worth it. On a sapper, it would have been very difficult, I'd say. Yes, definitely. Because eventually they uh, they land on mines that are already exploded. Yeah. Okay. Very risky if it was on empty or minefield. Good shot from Fisto, but that health bar. Yeah, the health yeah. bar is... Uh, uh, it's telling a clear story here. Yeah. I think there's even a double poison possible here. If you throw it from the inside to, uh, over the Paras head onto the Zapper. There is ops are firing. I do not think that works. Uh, That's not a good one. position for it. This will be a bad turn. He might even hit himself, I think. Oh, shoot. Never mind, he knew something I didn't. Uh, well, <laughs> he did hit himself at least, so I wasn't wrong on that. <laughs> Yay! I'm st I, I just stand corrected. That was just 100. Mm -hmm. It just looked like such a bad position for the fire. I think, I think the crucial thing is that the explosion of the Afrain projectile happened below the Paras feet, and because of that, all the flames just went up into the Para. Yeah. Which is devastating, of course. Uh, positioning, positioning, but this gonna has uh, his turn, so it isn't quite as bad as it could have been. <laughs> yeah, unfortunate for Mephisto. Cypher's played this absolutely perfectly. I think he would want to um, damage the gunner in the far side with this. He still has the sapper for the thousand pound shell as a target, and it's close enough to. So why would... Okay, it's still a thousand pound shell target after this, so... Yeah, I suppose. Yeah. I forgot Wetland that down the was... HP. This guy is still I feel on like 75. Cypher... He is, yeah. Cypher can afford to be not too fussy with his targets now. Especially if the few targets he does have are b uh, both on so good health. Yeah, exactly. Like, Cypher's picks are more, but they tend to be a little lower on health, I say. This looks short now. Oh, this is very short, I'm not sure. Okay. Mephisto's mortars are not good today. It's starting to be a bit uncharacteristic of Mephisto. It's so used to him being such an excellent player, like so consistent. Yeah, 
seems to be characteristic of this league. Have you seen the games that Pinstripe played? <laughs> um, can't remember if I have. It were it were a couple of games that uh, something something. I think I would rocket launch him to prepare for a poison skip. Because he's on 75. Yes. Uh, that is also good enough, I suppose. Damage is still damage, I suppose. Still I poison. Let's get range. Yeah. Uh, I saw the game between Pinstripe and Herp Derp. Which is a bit of a crazy one. This is exactly why I thought Cypher had such a good advantage, but Chill Hill is... What? Such an unpredictable map, and if you... You seem to be cutting out right now. Oh, sorry. Uh, no idea what... And it's the artillery's turn. I think now it's the time to kill the Sapper. Doesn't it reach? I feel like... It should reach, right? The thousand pound shell? Maybe it doesn't. Maybe it doesn't. This didn't reach and it was over half the power. So, good call on... Uh, Cypher to... Do what actually does damage. <laughs> oh, this could be. Yeah, it's a great shot. This is a very strong turn, I think. He wants to bunch them up, but he also wants to deal at least 43 damage to the gunner. I think it's good. Never mind, it was only 32. What? Oh, but the scout is dead instead. Oh. And now the gunner is, also, uh, is dead too. But the sapper takes extra damage from it. Ah. Oh jeez. What a turn. This is an abyss uh, that just dropped. Yeah, I think the only reason why Cypher is badly winning is because of his artillery now. Nah, why would Cypher go for the hard shot? <laughs> yeah, I was about to say... Yeah, keep it nice and easy. I'm also not sure... I guess you don't have any targets to hit with that anymore. And you want to get rid of your inventory too. That is a great body block as well. Yeah. What is he doing now? I don't see a way out of this, quite frankly. There is a uh, self heal, I oh. think, or jetpacks. Yeah. There should be jetpacks, I think. One. Yeah. Pack. Well, making. Was getting a bit of distance. <gasps> it's a miss, though. We've had two games where the artillery has been ignored. That's and just think about the gunner, uh, the power inside here, right? Played into Cypher's hands. Yeah, oh, he's got. He's got an inventory he needs to insta dive. Uh, Tons of loot. If he would want to win, if he doesn't, uh, if he didn't, Too oh, long. that's long. Mm. Yeah, Ghana should be dead now. He has no TNT left. 
I repeat the Sapa Snorty and he left. <laughs> wow. What did the gunner have? Oh. <laughs> don't see that for day. <laughs> I don't think that's going to come into play. And yeah, again, emptying the inventory. Although I feel like the uh, artillery might have been a better target at this point. Yeah, I think so. To be fair to Mephisto, if he that targeted artillery. Yeah, Beautiful shot. Mephisto's down to a sapper. Yeah, now the artillery isn't needed. There we go. No. If he chose to focus on artillery, not... Well, then he would have dealt less damage to the pigs, the pigs right? We'd probably fight... Exactly. Lose lose, I think. Yeah. Really rough luck. This is a good one. Very good hard turn. to hit. But I think the poison chat should be reaching but yeah, you can just do that. Jetpack once, rocket launcher once, and I think that's it. Nah. Jetpack twice, right? Uh, he's on he something? So, I think he's on 60 something, so if he has a rocket. He has a rocket, yeah. I would love to know if he's still alive or not. Okay, he's dead. And with that, with that, Cypher yeah. takes map 2 wow. as well. Excellent from Cypher. Such a good comeback in the first map, and that was just completely dominant in the second. Yes. So. Uh, great display of why Cypher justifiedly promoted to, oh, well done to uh, Hawks League from Middle League this year. Absolutely. Well, he's came close in a few games now. I think that one was coming, so... I really enjoyed this. I hope uh, Cypher keeps this up and can maybe even qualify. I'm not sure about the standings, uh, so I can't comment on that. But I think he lost most of his games so far. I'm not sure, though. Either way... I think this is his first victory. Oh. Well, yeah, still, it is a very, very solid victory. Gives him a chance nonetheless absolutely and we'll see you all in the next one bye